All right, guys, quick video right here. Oh, I got some pet staining. So this is enzyme, and this is peroxide, or 20 volume. Um, just to show you how effective it is. If I could do this with one hand, let me see. Okay, so enzyme. See how it disappeared? 20 volume disappears so nowadays when I'm doing enzymes I'm going ahead and put um, a peroxide booster in my pre-sprays and that's what it does um, if it's a small area or a few spots I'll, I'll put it in a pump up but I still have some enzymes and that's what I'm using right now so a lot of people have um, never seen the that happen in action But, uh, yeah, that's, that's what it does. It gets rid of that. And then you hit it with kind of a deodorizer. And then you get rid of the stain and the odor. So what I'm using here is um, Sager P Lime Zyme as the kind of the enzyme treatment. A lot of times you'll do this and it won't disappear. Um, what I'm told is it's color loss in the carpet. No need to be concerned. But if you're um, doing a re customer, put that in the uh, the notes. That way, next time you don't come back, you use your light, and all of a sudden you're seeing all whole bunch of stains when you already treated them. <laughs> so you don't double charge them for the same treatment if they don't need it. You know, kind of depend on the smell whether you need to do that again. Yeah, with the light and the... So now I go around with a deodorizer and kind of hit those areas. Hit out around. Um, get rid of the uh, dog dander smell. stuff works really good this is um eucalyptus um sager side and it's really um powerful but what i mean is uh it really does a job so if you put it down and when you're done extracting you can still smell a slight whiff of it and uh Customers like that usually, unless they're hypersensitive to smell. Real quick, guys, if you're thinking about getting into the carpet cleaning business, I do offer a step by step course down below all my videos. There's a link. Not just the technical side of it, but the business side of it. How to get those customers to call you. Also, the tools I love and use, down below also. How about this? So this is pretty spray.
kind of let the enzymes dwell for about 10 minutes. And I think I'll go ahead and put this pre-spray down, that's what we do. And then, agitate. All right, so it smells a whole lot better already. And although it doesn't look really dirty, um, we always do like a, a rinse front and back. Unless it's, I mean, almost brand new, you know, really, really, really light blue soil carpet. Then we can kind of just, when we pull back the wand, we do the rinse. Uh, just one so it doesn't overweight it when we don't need to but um, a lot of people kind of don't double rinse when they should um, kind of just kind of go across it and uh, it's not going to rinse it all all out unless you do a really good rinse just like if you're um, you know washing your hair or, or anything like if you're washing a piece of clothes or something and you just kind of dip it in and pull it out uh, you, you know, it's not going to get that clean, but if you dip it in there a couple times and kind of um, pull it out, it's going to get more off, right? I don't know if that's a good example. Maybe the hair thing is a better example. Um, but I think you know what I mean, right? Right? Yeah. Anyway, uh, this is a repeat customer. Uh, I'm using me about four three times and so three years so once a year they use me and he said they'll keep using me because I do a great job and he actually knows people a guy who had a business and the guy was in business for 30 years and he was doing the grandchildren's of the original clients <laughs> toward the end of his career so so yeah that's kind of a smart smart move Do good job so they keep calling you back on my phone again today because I've got to charge my GoPro again. I'm going to do a uh, video here soon on what I hope it needs to do. We've got two people working and where you can just be really efficient with what they work. Lots of the job. Because some people wonder how I can get to a, a job in an hour and a half and make it 400 bucks. You know, it's just uh, smart, working smart. You know? It's not skipping a step at all. It's 